There is a new car here with the GTA Pareco heist. And before we get into it and I show you guys the full review, make sure to go down below, like and subscribe because I'm going to be dropping reviews and doing gameplay on the new heist and all the new vehicles coming to GTA 5. So you guys are going to want to stay tuned for that. The Pegasagi Torator or Torator, if I'm getting that wrong, is a new aquatic car coming to GTA 5. And it is very similar to the Stromberg. Some people are calling it the Stromberg Mark II, similar to the Oppressor and the Oppressor Mark II. I personally think it's like that because it is ex it's pretty similar to the Stromberg, except it's better, it looks nicer, it seats more people. And the coolest new addition to it that I like is it has a rocket boost that can not only be used on land, but also in the water. So I, a big issue I had with the Stromberg was I noticed it was really slow in the water and there was really no point using it in the water. But with not only being able to use it to get into your submarine and out of your submarine and parking it in there, you can also move even faster than boats with the rocket boost. This car also is pretty tanky as well. It can take up to six, count it, six oppressor missiles. That is actually more than the Strongberg. That is over double the amount of missiles that the Stromberg can take from the oppressor. And it also has the highly touted Stromberg missiles, the ones that counter the Mark II, the ones with the best tracking out of all the missiles in GTA V. This car is sick. And for you car show lovers out there, before you even have to ask, yes, this car has loads and loads of visual customizations on it. Everything from rear bumpers, front bumpers, back bumpers, spoilers. You can change all the windows because the tops and the doors are glass. There is so much you can do with this car. Unlike the Schongberg, this car is amazing. And honestly, the final verdict with the price limit being just a little bit over $3 million, I think this car, depending on how you use it, like if you're a person that likes to grind out crate missions or just missions of the sort, this is going to be the perfect vehicle for you. It is anti-griefer. You can get rid of those oppressor users. It is fast. It's multi-purpose. It's armored. And you can see an entire CEO squad inside of it. There is not very many land cars better than this one in GTA 5. The seal I give this one is a purchase now. Purchase it, customize it, rock with it, show all your friends. This car is a bona fide W. But anyway, that's just my opinion. Make sure to go check the car out yourself and buy it with the new KO Pareko heist that has came out today. Make sure to go down below, like, and subscribe. We are.